Today I show you how to switch between input languages on your Samsung Galaxy Android phone. If you have multiple languages on your phone and you have a note taking app, for example, this is the Google Keep app, and I have the keyboard open and I'm typing something, but it's in the wrong language, it's not in English. If I want to change the input language from Romanian to English, back to English, and I want to the autocorrect to work properly and also the letters to have something like this so it's correct giving me the right suggestions and not some foreign languages that i use maybe sometimes the text correction might not work well and i want to switch back to english from here and i could actually switch back to romanian very easily anytime and for samsung you might have the setting with different modes for example now i have the the language now i have the language key which is very easy switch between between these languages it's really easy and you see as i switch it will change the suggestion but you might have a different setting so i'll show you how to do that also so go back here i, I remove that suggestion go to the settings of the keyboard in settings under the languages you will see the languages you have you can add or remove languages here but you can also change the languages switching method if you have a language key you might be used to it but if you have only the space bar you don't have the language key then it's gone so then you can use the space bar if you don't have the language key here you can still swipe between the languages you can switch to english to romanian like that to russian english romanian russian english romanian but then when you swipe the other direction it will change the direction so this is actually pretty useful to change the language in one way or another on the google keyboard you just have to long press and it will show a menu but here it doesn't show the menu and i actually prefer to have the language key there so i will use the language key but i wanted to show you also the way if you don't have the language key then what happens you can long press on the language key also to choose the language if you have a lot of languages long press on the language key and you can see the languages there but if you only have two it's easy to press once and it switches to between them but i think more than two then you might want to use the long press on language key so you can choose between in the list maybe four also could be uh, like if i have greek here it would be also much harder to go scroll scroll between the languages like that much easier to choose it from the list in this way but usually the english uk or english us is what you might want to have most of the time on your phone but i show you how to switch between the languages so you know so you know how to go back into them you can also add and remove languages very easily thanks for watching